Uh, here's my 1450, and I've had some bad luck with it. Well, it's, I like the old tractor. Runs good. I love the old tractor. But I had it out there in the snow the other day. Going towards my shed. Had the white trailer back over there hooked up to it. Going down through there. All at once it went. And just died. I looked down through the dash. I seen smoke. I thought, what the hell? I popped the hood and looked in there and there was a flame on top of the ignition. It's in my backpack in the, the house, but, uh, and, uh, ignition was on fire. I didn't have no tools to take the ignition, the battery wire off, because somebody, they had bypassed the fuse before. And, uh, I went over there, run down to my shed as fast as I could, grabbed a pair of pliers, run back, and took the battery cable off. But when I pulled the damn battery cable off, it broke the fucking post off. So I'm going to see if I can tap it. Because I hate to buy a new battery. It's a good battery. Just the post broke off. And uh, I've had to take a bunch of shit. I had to pull the gas tank off. And then, I mean, it just burnt that old ignition. I, it's sitting there short now. I'm going to have to rewire it. Somebody just gobbed all the wiring up in it. But uh, I had to, first thing I done was pull the gas tank off. Uh, then, I, well, first I pulled the side panels off. Then I pulled the gas tank off. Pulled the gas tank brackets off. Then I had to, uh, uh, then I uh, started working on the uh, dash. I unhooked all the wires to the da dash gauges over there. The, the two uh, bolts going to the throttle, they are, uh, let me see if I can find them. I got a whole bunch of shit. They're right there. And they had a fillet, like a, not a fillet, but a uh, Allen wrench head on them. And them things were stripped. God, them things were stripped. So I took cutoff wheel and I cut a notch into it and took this one out enough with a straight screwdriver I get vice grips on it and vice grip it out. That one up here at the top, I got it finally vice gripped out without having to cut it. These two over here, I just had to cut the heads off with a chisel. I'm going to take a pair of vice grips and turn them out. I marked my dash up a little bit, but I'm going to see if I can get another one from a guy I know. Then I had to pull the throttle cable all loose. And right now I'm trying to take them bolts right there out. I'm just about done heating that up with the torch so I can get it loose. But uh, when I get done with it, it ain't going to be no faulty wiring shit. I'm going to see if I can get a brand new wiring harness for it. But yeah. Well, there's an update on my 1450. Bye.